Hi everyone. I am starting a new series on post harvest processing of fruits and vegetables. This topic would be beneficial for all the students preparing for ARS Net Food Technology and also for the students pursuing BSc and MSc courses. India is the largest producer of fruits and vegetables in the world and being the largest producer 70 to 80% of production is lost during the transportation and storage so a lot of attention is required to minimize post harvest loss it is said that food loss and food waste both these terms are same they are synonyms but the fact is these two terms are totally different food loss occurs at production post harvest or processing stages whereas food waste occurs at consumer and retail level now we will discuss about the maturity index also known as harvesting index we know that cell is the basic structural and functional unit of life when this cell divides it forms a cluster of cells like this a cluster of cells is formed now this cluster of cells further grow in size and get matured and after maturation ripening happens and at last senescence and cell death occurs now maturation or maturity it is a stage when the tissues of fruits and vegetables are fully developed and only after maturation fruits and vegetables get ripened so ripening is the stage when fruits and vegetables uh, become sweeter softer and acceptable for consumption and ripening stage always comes after the maturation process this is a plant having an immature fruit during its maturation plants supply the food material to this immature fruit when this immature fruit gets matured a abscission layer or a corky layer is formed in the end of the stem these both layers prohibit the entry of food supply to the mature fruit now this mature fruit is totally depends upon its own reserves and characteristic flavor color are also developed during this process if the fruits are harvested before their maturation period or during ripening time then the sugar acid or brix acid ratio of the fruit is abnormal and when the fruits are harvested over the maturation time or over ripening is done then the fruits are susceptible to various microorganisms to cause spoilage so it is very important to pick up the fruits and vegetables at correct stage of maturity in order to facilitate the proper ripening distance transportation and long term storage life maturity indices indicates the readiness of the commodity for harvest it means whether the commodity is mature or not whether it is ready for harvest or not so it simply determines the harvesting date it is defined in the terms of either their physiological maturity or commercial maturity in physiological maturity it refers to a stage in fruits and vegetables when maximum growth and maturation occurred it means physiological maturity occurs when development of fruits and vegetable is over it is associated with full ripening in a fruit and we know that after ripening senescence or cell death occurs whereas in commercial maturity it means when a plant part possesses the necessary characteristics for use by consumers so it refers to a state of plant organ required by a market harvesting maturity should meet the following criteria it should be at a state of its peak condition when reaches the consumers it should be at a maturity stage which allows the commodities to develop the acceptable flavor and appearance it should be at a size required by the market it should be non toxic and should have an adequate shelf life harvesting maturity is determined by the following criteria by measuring the heat units by computing the days from blossom to harvest period by visual means like color size shape by physical tests like determining the firmness and softness of a commodity by using pressure tests 
ease of separation, density, grading. By chemical tests like determining the total solids, starch content, sugar acid or bricks acid ratio. By physiological test like respiration method. So that's all. Thanks for watching. I hope it would be helpful for you. In the next lecture, we will discuss its second part that is factors affecting the post-harvest quality of fruits and vegetables. You can follow me on Instagram. My Instagram handle is Food Tech World, where you can find interesting updates related to food technology.